In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up an API in Janitor AI. Now, this is a very quick and simple thing to do, so make sure you watch this video all the way to the end so you don't miss any important steps. So, the first thing you want to do is head over to Janitor AI, and when you are logged into your account, you can go up to the top right corner, and you just want to look for this little icon. Now, when we click on it, we're going to see a few more different options, but we want to go down to the third one, which should be My Characters. Now, if you've already created a character, you'll find it in this section here, and we just want to simply click on the character which we're trying to set up the API for. It will look something like this, and we can now scroll down to the bottom, and we can choose to chat. It will now open up the chat, and we can actually look for these three lines in the top right corner. And when we click on it, we're going to see the top option, which is API settings. So go ahead and click on that. And from here, we can see the API settings for Janitor, OpenAI, and also Cobold AI. Now, in order to set up the API, we're going to go ahead and choose OpenAI. And we can now select the model. So you want to pick whichever one you actually have. But in my case, I'm just going to choose GPT 3.5 Turbo. From there, we can choose my own API key. And from here, we're going to paste in our OpenAI key. Now, if you don't know how to get that, you're going to have to first type in OpenAI to Google. And we should see this top link here, which is openai.com. So click on this. And you want to go to the top right corner to log in and just sign into your account. Or if you don't yet have one, create an account. Now, when you're signed in, they'll ask if you want to be taken to ChatGPT or API. As soon as we're trying to set up an API, we're going to choose the right option, which is API. So we then get taken to this page. And we just want to hover over to this left hand side to see all these different options. And we can select this one, which is API keys. Now from here, we can choose to create a new secret key by clicking this button here. And we just want to give it whatever name we want. We can then click create secret key. And we will then receive a secret key, which we can copy to our clipboard. And then we can go back into Janitor AI. From here, we can click on this open AI key section. And we just want to paste in that key. And after we've done that, we can click check API key. And from there, it will now be connected. So that's how you can set up an API in Janitor AI. I hope you found this video helpful and thanks for watching.